Members of the Coalition of Non-Governmental Organizations in St. Kitts and Nevis are calling on political parties to cease the defacing of public property recently evident in the current political climate leading into general elections. In a press release issued 14 July by the Chamber of Industry and Commerce, a member of the coalition, concern was expressed over the upsurge in the unlawful painting of public structures, some having historical significance. The release states in part, quote, We implore the leaders of each political party in St. Kitts and Nevis, who have openly and proudly executed the code of conduct for the political process, to publicly and privately denounce such behaviors and discourage your supporters from taking such childish and vandalistic actions. Paint applied by political party activists in public areas and on historical structures should be removed immediately, end quote. It has been noted that several areas of stoneworks, sections of buildings and public walls have been defaced with paint of party colors and various forms of graffiti. The Coalition of Non-Governmental Organizations also pointed to, quote, political activists, unquote, defacing and destroying the campaign posters and billboards of their opponents. In the interests of peace, maturity, decency, democracy, and fairness, the release states, the coalition wants election officials and persons in authority to ensure the general elections that the electoral laws and regulations are fully observed and not circumvented. Glenn Bart reporting for SK Newsline.